And hello, folks. A lot of people always are in sheeple shock. It's snowing outside. Sheeple shock. Or monkeys up in the tree complaining about the weather. In denial, even if the house is burning, 90% of normal people won't listen. Rudy and Alaskan Prepper warn people. A lot of Prepper channels, the old guys, we warned this. 80% of the preppers warned this, okay? Unfortunately, 80% of the preppers were, didn't listen to us, okay? A possible threat, one-way thinking to you and your group, okay? A lot of people, we had rolling blackouts. So, I have a generator. I have battery bank uh, backup. Do I look worried? No. Okay, they want things to go their way. Why do we have rolling blackouts? Because you're a dumbass. Plain and simple. Pride, anger, disbelief, um, over, I can't remember what I wrote, overwhelmed, and shut down mentality. Okay, I'm not going to write this down. I keep writing it down. YouTube gets mad at me. Right now, we're ending the fifth month of the seven months of hell. January and February of the dark winter. All right. I did warn you, longer Brandon's in office, worse it gets. All right. Yeah, Marilyn, make everybody go to electricity. How many blackouts do you have, Marilyn? Yeah, a lot of people froze to death or get stuck in cars or couldn't leave their homes. Think about it, folks. Seven months of hell. I was right. You were wrong. <laughs> and this has started in September. I warned people. Rudy on Alaska Prepper warned people. A lot of other channels warned you. They were getting firewood. They were getting supplies. And this is you. Sheeple shock. With your mouth open and don't know what the hell's going on. All right? Rudy was frustrated. He did a video explaining what was going on and I feel sorry for him because it never got through so anyway we'll finish with that and yeah, let's see again my blogs and thoughts I don't do merch not yet I don't have an Amazon affiliate no membership no super chats I'm not a dealer of food buckets freeze right now. I don't sell subscription boxes magazines books I don't sell flashlights nothing like that not gear or weapons. I don't do any of that. Okay. I will talk about my thoughts, rationing, cooking, gardening, camping, survival, making money, and dirty tricks. And you know the rest. Okay. Now, a lot of people knows me, and I know a lot of things. We'll put it over there. I've got bunches of paperwork. Now, a lot of people remember Walter Mil Mil Miller. If you ever listen to Coast to Coast with Art Bell, uh, Mel Walters had troubles with this, this hole in his backyard. Okay? It's on his property. Neighbors have been dumping trash. People have been dumping trash until he went on Art Bell and he's trying to figure out where all this stuff is going. And then guess who listens into Art Bell? Yeah, the military. Yavol. Yeah, they find out it's a hole. And I warn people, phase six holes. They're all over the place, folks. Do not screw around with them. Do not tell the military. Do not tell the federal government. I don't care if they say, you must obey. I want to live. Either they'll bump you off. The other side will bump you off. Corporate will bump you off. So don't trust nobody. And if they give you that weird look, pop a 38 in their skull. Do not be confused. I have several people like, uh, I don't know where I'm at. So do not be confused. Be alert. Try to trace your steps back through the entrance and back to our reality. Okay? You don't want to mess around. I know several points in British Columbia. Okay, Vancouver Island, 
Washington State. This is what I tell people. Why in the hell are you moving to Washington? Worse, Oregon. Why in the hell are you moving to Oregon? And people, it's green. It's life. No, you're mentally insane. It's like every whole area, including California, has this zone of people like it's green and it's not like the big city. We could go out into the green. Yeah, right. Somebody is smoking crack a lot. All right. Do not be, become uh, distressed. Like most animals in nature won't go near these holes. They're not stupid. Even Bigfoot don't go near these. Okay. Remain where you are. Okay. Turn around. Walk quietly backwards. Do not make attention grabbing. All right. You have like maybe a 15 minute thing. Go back. You should have your everyday carry on your person. You should have your emergency sustenance vest. You should have your day pack. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, make sure you check out Harshman Hills. That's James' channel. He has 2,000 uh, subs, uh, 244 subs. Go check out all three channels. He has two other channels. Lots of videos, lots of shorts. Go check out James at Harshman Hill. Okay, where was I? I did this last year, and I'll do it again for Dad on YouTube. How to survive in 2022 to 2023. Live below your means. Be humble. Choose a modest home. Not a mansion. Spartan furnishings. Forget about class. Be humble. Be on the lookout for freebies. Eat frugally. Frugally. Frugal. You know, eat sensible. Downsize your meal. Only buy what you need. Keep warning people this. They keep looking at me. That's why you have a spacecraft that takes two weeks to get to the moon. I won't talk about my own theories on that because if I do, if I talk about anti-gravity, free energy, uh, what you call reconverting the figuration of water, because water is an unstable element, and there's certain things you could do with it. <laughs> But I can't do that because Uncle Alan doesn't want to die. Yeah, he committed suicide. He died in surgery. He had cancer. You know, a lot of people who deviate, well, he didn't have that link. Yeah, he died from cancer. But he looked so happy. He died of cancer. Yeah, that was the official report. How come he had so much thorium in the system? Yeah, I know why. Okay? You leave me alone and stop flying the stupid things over my house. If you want to ask me, take me out to dunk, uh, what you might call it? The ice cream place. Baskin and Robbins. Get me a cup, uh, nice ice cream sundae or banana split and we'll talk. What do you need to know? And yes, I know your stupid projects. God, you're a bunch of idiots. Okay. Let's see. What do we have? What do we have? Okay, rough summer. Again, indication. Inflation, monetary. Lack of budget, bad management. Lack of price control, higher taxes. No control on spending. Too many taxes. Overprinting of money. Overspending. Yeah, they gave $40 billion to Ukraine. Isn't that stupid, folks? Okay, again, supply chain. Both military and civilian transports, trucks, railroad, and ships, planes are in bad shape. Okay, if we have a war, a good one, right now we're in the resource war, a lot of people, the higher ups and the elite, either they plan for it or they're idiots. I say both. 
okay? We're going to have supply chain issues. Go look at the Midwest right now. Go look at Colorado. Go look at Michigan, okay? Go look at the East Coast. Some things are not going to be there for a couple of weeks, folks. You should have stocked up like we told you. Okay, bad management unions, overseas plants, over-dependent on just about everything on the just-in-time system. Now, Will and me were talking about this on one of his live streams. Unfortunately, Will passed away, and I think I know why, because we were talking about that. Okay, number three. It, it, we're going into from La Nina to La Nino. So expect to have massive heat waves all over the country and droughts. Poor resource management. Poor resource management. Okay. Progressive politics. Okay. And people were not educated or informed or negotiated or talked what's good for them. Okay. Instead, they got this crap. Crime is going to be on the upcrease. Do you like Texas? Shoot the son of a bitches. Use language. Homeless. Okay, Karen Bass says, I'll solve the homeless emergency. For 40, uh, what, last 30 years? You guys didn't do nothing. You're responsible. Look at Sacramento, the new homeless capital. Uh, Bay Area and LA has been dumping all their homeless people there. Why? Because they know there are a lot of stupid people in the state capital, and they don't want to take responsibility. Okay? If you make me in charge at homeless czar, I'll get rid of the problem one way or the other. Gabo. Okay? And I'll go after anybody who stops me, too. Okay? Crime, homelessness, mental and drug addiction will be on the rise, big time, caused by progressive politics. You know who we're talking about, all those socialists. Also socialists and liberal too. Don't defund the police, that's really stupid. Look at San Francisco, they want to give killer robots. Don't support known terror groups like Antifa, or the BLM, <clears throat> who just got caught with all those machine guns. And military weapons. That isn't the Second Amendment. They're trying to overthrow the government, stupid. Political upheaval. It's a communist, socialist insurgency and corruption. Okay, there are two things. It's a communist, socialist insurgency. So if anybody tell you, let's give communism a try or socialism, you stomp on them. All right? They're one of them. Corruption. Okay? It's like in that movie, They Live, everybody with the special glasses. Yep, yeah, they're one of them. Okay, that, that's, uh, that's number five. Let's see what else I wrote. Yeah. Okay, cyber attacks, um, power system, internet, crypto, banks, smartphones. Okay, this is occurring right now, folks. And on a power system, uh, they're going to the old-fashioned one. Get a rifle and blow out the transformer stations. It's a lot easier. Just shoot the power line, stupid. Yeah, I could do that. Yeah, and usually it's like they're underneath the power line. They shoot up and the 20,000 or 60,000 volt line lands on top of them, frying them in their truck and the cooked sausages on the hot engine hood. Okay, a lot of people aren't that smart, folks. Number seven, this summer, war. It could be a limited nuclear strikes. This is, remember, 
if you want to win the war, so China or Russia or whoever has got to be with us, you got to hit everything on the east of the 100th meridian. That guarantees you a win. Okay? We lose four. Win one. Guess who we win on one? And China, that's your warning. Don't do something stupid. Also goes for North Korea. Do not do something stupid. All right? We lose four. Win one. This also applies to the resource war, which I got to do a separate video on that because people are too stupid to understand what's going on. Sorry, this is for next year. Why this is long. This is Uncle Alan's prediction for 2023. Alright? Yeah, let's see. Yeah. Well, I got part two. Okay, part two. This is from notes from, from 1982 and on. Uh, the big one. Good chance of a 10.5 earthquake. Probably December or November. Don't know. Uh, let's see. Alaska ends in Peru. Tidal wave the northwest. Volcanic events. There's several things I like about volcanic events. And so far, Etna and the other one that I've been, I was thinking of Stromboli. I have one of those two. Um, uh, volcanic events. Power, water, and uh, what's it called? Electrical system disruptions. Solar storms. Southern Hemisphere. This is going to be interesting because we're going to either have affect the South Pole, Africa, South America, or Australia. Uh, Japan, repeat of 2012. All the islands will be fe feeling it. So you better get your disaster ready. And China, do not do anything too stupid towards J Japan. If they go down, you go down. Beijing will be a dust cloud. Like they will take nine nukes and wipe Japan off the face of the earth. Japan has 400 nuclear weapons unaccounted for, and they did it for a long time since the 80s. They're going to nuke your ass to hell. Okay, that goes for North Korea. Stop saber rattling. They don't want to, what happened to Hiroshima and Nagasaki, they don't want to do that to anybody else. Okay? They will do it if pushed to the brim, and they will take you down. So stop doing that. And North Korea, China is getting ready for a six-part uh, six part civil war. It's going to break into six regions, and they're going to be shooting at each other. So you could sell them a lot of weapons and ammo, because everybody be throwing everything at everybody. And it will be either communist versus communist, mother versus father, father versus son, mother versus daughter, dog versus cat. It's going to be one of the biggest wars. And we're not involved with it. Okay? Until they start doing something stupid. Like invading Alaska. Okay? So think about that, folks. It's not very funny when China goes in a six-way uh, nuclear war with itself each region like we're tired of Beijing look what they did to Hong Kong and Shanghai and all the others and people like screw this we could do our own government and go after the central government and the central government is a bunch of old people young Turks are like uh, I can't wait this long to get my cut screw them I'm going after these bo boneheads I'll start the newer newer People's Republic of China and then Taiwan, if you've got the knowledge, and if you get India, Taiwan, and Australia, and UK, and probably a couple other European countries, you could make a foothold in southern China fairly easy. You know, Beijing, formerly known as West Taiwan, because they're still in the system. If you don't like the system, vote Taiwan in. Okay, that'll stop the six-way nuclear war. Okay, another thing is, we're going to have a new Pope. And like I said, congratulations to Pope Rollo. First African Pope. Not African American. African Pope. Good job. Uh, 2026, start of the golden period. Uh, until 2023 or the next thousand years. 2023 is 
you don't want to know. If we're okay with 2026 and we break down all the secrets and punish all those people and corporations and the military industrial complex. Okay, start of the golden age, golden period. And find out a lot of you people are nuts. Uh, currency, world money and virtual currency goes thus. Invest in silver. I keep telling people this, but everybody looks at old Uncle Al like he's nuts. Has some Kwan gone wrong? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, five things that drive, drive Uncle Al nuts. Every state in the union is using 1984 and Anifu Farm as, uh, whatchamacallit? Oh, let's see. As a playbook, it's a powder keg ready to explode communist insurgency by radical elements. Purge of unstable radical elements by the DMC summer of the long knives. Okay, 2023, if you're a Democrat, don't go near them. Don't start their car. Don't eat their food. Uh, when you hear some clicking sounds, walk away. All right. Uh, we might have a military coup. Let's eat a uh, coup, a uh, military coup. Okay, good time is in May and June and July. That's the best time to take out Captain Crazy and crew. Hopefully, Captain Crazy and crew, he dies in office or medically removed. He's replaced or he's arrested. I hope he does all three or all four. Okay. Let's see. Oh, number three, effects of the mountains of the moon, a.k.a. chaos, mob violence, protests and riots, crime and personal violence, brainwashing, mind control goes nuts. They've been doing psychops since God knows when and driving people crazy. Everybody infected. So I don't trust nobody. You make a sudden move, you might get either 44, 45, 9 millimeter, 38 special, 32, 25, 22, uh, butcher knife. I don't care. You're going to go down. Okay. Number four, Paragon shift. 180, uh, 100 degree change in all timelines. The impossible, impossible happens. Things change or disappear. Reality disrupted. We're going to have fun in 2023. That's why I don't live in Alabama. And remember, folks, the Georgia, Georgia Guidestone was a warning. You didn't listen to it. So too bad. Okay, remember back in the old days. Go back and look for this. It's partial in code so Uncle Island doesn't get bumped off. December 27, 20. 19 to December now. One year anniversary of Cecil. That's code. You never would understand that. And I see the year 2020. Most people can't handle the five phases of the attack. DOE. We had diseases. A lot of them. Now phase two. Weather and natural disasters. What's going on right now? Duh. Phase three, starvation and economic warfare. Phase four, they did a really good job in 2021. Them are in public office, big tech, social media's position of power. Duh. And right now they're working phase five. They take your kids. And if you watched and listened and go to school board meetings, they're getting close where you don't have kids anymore in your house. This is a long one, folks. You could go watch a shorter one of somebody cooking something or dancing or doing fitness. But Uncle Alan's so far 19 to 0. Okay. Continuing the side effects of the alien invasion that was code. 
Look around the year 2022 to 2023. Are they human or alien? Little joke there. Second phases uh, from the attack. Phase six, remember I told you holes. Okay, possible side effects of evasion. Space time is ruined. Natural, supernature, or collapse of reality. Starting in Liverpool, England, and goes around the world. I know where all, all the stuff on the West Coast. So if you're skiing or walking in the snow or taking a poo out in the woods and you disappear, too bad. Okay, I did warn you. Phase seven, organ jackers. Uh, guess what the Ukraine and the UK is doing together and also America on their dead civilians and dead soldiers. Organ jackers. The elite are harvesting human organs for profit and survival. Children, refugees, etc. That includes dead soldiers. I don't want to see any dead American soldiers who have their organs removed. Probably get bumped off for that remark. Okay, again, organ jackers. Phase seven. Go scan around and see who's doing organ transplant. Phase eight, mountains of the moon. Not only China does it, not only Russia, America, UK, a lot of countries that you say, oh, they're socialists, they're very advanced. Yeah, until they gut you and take all your good stuff out. Okay, phase eight, mountains of the moon. Mankind goes nuts. After a year of brainwashing, mind control, social, secu so, bleh, social conditioning, people are going crazy. Okay, phase eight, propaganda, persuasion, and programming at its highest level. Guess who's been doing that for a long time? And the FBI says, oh, we didn't do it. CIA says, we didn't do it. NSA says, we didn't do it. Yeah, right. Okay, so don't believe me. See what happens. The good thing is, aliens from space. Please land in Japan. They're not that nuts. America or Russia, they're too stupid. Three alien races, the big boys will come. It'll be the childhood end. Okay? You don't have to worry about nuclear weapons. They don't care about regular conventional weapons. They kind of laugh at it. It's kind of hilarious. And they know what you did in the 50s and 60s. So they're prepared. Okay? All your electronic systems, all your gear goes... <laughs> How good are you with rocks and stick? Okay? And you don't want to see the Metrons. Phase 10. Because we are in a resource war, this might set off a limited tactical nuclear Brush wars, the East Coast, 100 million dead. Because if they nuke the East Coast, that solves 80% of the world's problem. Okay, sorry if you live on the East Coast. Because it's on the east side of the 100th meridian. People still don't get that. All right, I do. EU, 30 million people. Canada, 5 million people. Near East, 4 million, 40 million people. China, 100 million people. Civil wars, revolutions, and chaos. Now, this might bu bump up a bit. Okay, close to half a billion. But China is going to go into a six-way nuclear war with itself. Okay, you got civil wars, you got revolutions, you have chaos. Take your pick. Of course... If everybody asked old Uncle Al and just give him universal income, everybody owes money to Uncle Al. Uncle Al will solve all your problems. No more freezing into your house. No more these stupid electric cars, these solar energy farms. They're all bullshit. It's con. The windmills, that's a joke. Only thing those windmills good is killing condors, bald eagles, every kind of pollinators in the world. You wonder how come your food prices are going up? Yes. Okay.
Top 10 predictions from 2022 notes from to do 2023. We have blood and terror, dirty wars. Right now we are in the resource wars, limited nuclear events, 3 billion dead, dying, and sick. Number two, hunger, starvation, no food, man eats man, cannibalism by mothers and kids. Paris, always under siege. I don't know who, German, Poland, Russia, could be a combination of two, Africa. Who knows? Inflation. If you don't stop the stupidity, eat the rich and poor, new robber barons and the masses. Okay? You have a choice. You could be a robber baron or the masses. Uncle Alan's going to be a pirate. I'm going to feed on both. I'm not a nice guy. I've pushed to the level. So you could do that for 2023. I, robot. Thank God. Ian Musk robot failed. Uh, death of a dictator and followers. Captain Crazy and his crowd go into the light. The end for the Zoomer. The end for the Zoomer. For the Zoomers. That anybody from bo uh, born between these years, 1999 to 2010, you're the Zoomer generation. You're gonna die. Too bad. Uh, it's the end. You could be a whole bunch of things. Somebody sneezes on you, you die. You drink the water, you die. You ingest microplastic, you die. You die from cancer, you die. You have a heart murmur, you die. Okay? At least Alpha and Omegas survive and they learn their lesson. Asteroid, the, coming to the end of the year, we have missed eight of the biggest things that would kill us. Thank God. Okay, and number 10, I forgot something. It's really bad. You don't want to know about it. I'll remember it one of these days. I guess that's keeping me alive. Because everybody in, uh, I know, like Art Bell, they're taking down notes like, we have to know what the hell it is, number 10. I forget things. I'm old. Okay. Biden's building it better back plans and helping the communists and big business to take over in 2022. Enslave America. You're a smurf. Already more crime, more BLM, more Gestapo. Destroying the economy, food supply. Starve America. Feed China. No federal backing of the states. CCP controlling certain states. Evil trio. Politician, pervert, and terrorist. Gee, was I wrong on this? Okay. Think about it. Their bill with the 4,000 pages in it, if they knock out climate, climate change and a few other things, it would be a lot better than this. But they won't do it. Okay, folks. You have a nice holiday and Happy New Year. And that's my predictions for 2023. Okay, I'm hitting 19 to 0. So let's find out who will survive. Right? A lot of people don't talk about past prepper survival channels. And they only barely mention the few who survived. Okay. A lot of people didn't. A lot of people disappeared. A lot of people are not on this platform anymore or gone. Well, what happened to him? He died of cancer. He got hit by a truck. He was found in the garage, his belly full of sleeping pills, and the motor running. That doesn't sound normal. No, but he killed his, also his dog, his wife, and two kids. They all had sleeping pills, including the dog. Yeah, right. Okay, folks, I'll catch you later. Be nice to one another. Be good, because you don't know what's coming up, and I do. And I'll be seeing you. You have a nice year. Happy New Year's. Bye now. <laughs> oh, it's not fear porn. It's bad entertainment. And Walt Disney, if or Disney Corp, 
if you want to save your butts, I got a simple for Disney Plus or a movie, and I'll make you more money or recover all your losses, and I could work with the idiots you have. Bye now.